I gave myself seven days to go viral on TikTok. For the past several months on TikTok, we have been in the lazy era of content. Everyone's For You page is filled up with Family Guy and Subway Surfer clips, and it's quite annoying. And if you can't beat them, you join them. So this is what I came up with. Essentially, the business model is I take a streamer's clip, post it on TikTok. I started the account on December 13th and starting off pretty well. Over a thousand views on my first TikTok. And this was my first video that did well. This one amassed over 200,000 views and it was a good start to my TikTok. But then it happened. People got mad. There's a couple things I think about when making TikToks for my main channel. On my main TikTok, all the videos don't really pass every single test. But what I do like to think about are these. What's the hook? What's going to get people to stay and watch the whole video? Is it a movie? A movie has a beginning, a middle, and an end. Does your TikTok pay off? And the over the shoulder test. Can you watch the video with no audio and enjoy it? In around eight days or so, I gained over 2.3 million views and grew over a thousand followers. All right, it's the next day and here's some things I learned through the past seven days. Now, I didn't just learn this, but if people argue, it's very good for the video with the engagement. A lot of times people comment and the video is still running. That's how you get the watch time. And if you are looking for some TikTok tips, here are my tips. A lot of TikTok creators will ask questions in the comments, a lot of times unrelated to the video, but it does help engagement. When you're starting out, you should be very consistent with your videos. I found with my main TikTok that I wasn't getting to the right audience for the longest time, so I had to keep pushing and pushing until TikTok put me in that right audience. And that was mainly because I was switching up my content a lot. So it may take a second for you to get in that niche, but once you're in, I'm pretty sure you're in, unless you switch out and then you're gonna probably have to do that same thing again if it's very different from your regular niche. And this one's a little bit harsh. Blame yourself, don't blame TikTok. I promise that TikTok does not look at your account and say that they don't wanna push your videos. Probably making bad videos or videos that people don't wanna see. So take a step back, look at your content and be real with yourself. I've had to tell myself many times that my content sucked and I enjoyed this little challenge I gave myself. I know that it's probably easier to get a million views on a shroud video than it is on a texture video, but I'm still pretty proud of what I could do with that account. And I'm excited to see what other endeavors I get in 2023. I hope you guys had a happy new year and I'll see you guys later.